G'day guys, I'm Jason, CEO of Nextpack. I'm Don Loomis, the Vice President of the Micro Security and Software Business Unit at Maxim Integrated. And we just had an awesome hackathon event between Maxim and Nextpack. We saw some great projects uh, such as the gesture control, color sensing, uh, temperature and distance measurement. It's a competitive bunch, it was Battle of the Nerds, yeah. and uh, I think everybody wanted to make sure they had a real working demo, not yeah. just a, a PowerPoint deck. The team came together today or this week to put together some modules for field sales and field applications. But we believe that there are other uses for it. Uh, for example, uh, anyone that's a hobbyist or uh, maybe even students could, could take the case with uh, different modules. Uh, the modules are oscilloscope, DMM, power supplies, basically we do a digital logic analyzers. And so all this equipment basically is portable and, and can be put in their pocket, carried with them wherever they go. The NextPack platform has been really fun to work with. It was very easy to get going, uh, quickly get a prototype out there and, and get results. So you don't have to know a whole lot about you know actual coding in C or HTML, anything like that. So it's really easy to pick up and get going. So we're using the Max Q616. Uh, blaster base to communicate with the television. Uh, right now I'm just working on like uh, making the, this a little bit more user friendly, putting in like triangles for the arrow keys if you want channel up or channel down. So the, <clears throat> so the sensor on the back of this is the green board right here and we're using one of the next pack uh, provided modules that's an LED. That's our light source. Uh, normally we'd have that light around the sensors with some shielding. Right. And you can see that it's actually showing the color values, and then it'll actually show a swatch of color. So that shows the actual color swatch uh, right there. Um, so we are basically working on the uh, eye bottom based um, temperature sensor. This is the eye bottom. So in, in the demo in the afternoon, we're going to show exactly what we're doing. <laughs> Our idea for the device is to get the functionality of this laser gun, laser temperature sensing gun, mm -hmm. along with a distance calculation, so we know how big the measurement spot is. It will make our, our measurement much more accurate. So we could we would output a graph of data, send it to obviously some kind of application in the cloud where we can store it, and then we can later use that time stamp temperature and distance data to go back and figure that out. You know, the idea is you get find enough resolution to where you can do things like this. You Correct. Can do, you can go up, down, you can obviously swipe left, right, side to side. And it can and it will and it can detect that, yeah. And it will just give you an answer. It'll just say this is the action that I decoded. But ultimately the one winner is BitHeads number eight. It will be unanimous among all the judges. Uh, congratulations. In the end, uh, I think we, we had a great uh, session. It was, a, it was a pressure test for our, for our new technology. Uh, and going forward, we hope to do more and more events. It was impressive how fast they could bring up the next pack platform and, and the Maxim platform on Embed and bring everything together to make a prototype. But we learned some things that we can improve. Our next event will be with uh, Orange Silicon Valley in San Francisco towards uh, the start of November, and uh, we've got one in December with Texas A&M.